guys, it's Ashley here. Welcome back to another Wolves video. Today I'm going to be previewing tomorrow's game um, against Birmingham at home, which is a must win if we want to secure promotion. Um, that's if Fulham do um, beat Brentford um, tonight. If they fail to beat Brentford, we'll be handed promotion without kicking the ball. But personally, I'd prefer uh, to do it in front of Birmingham, really. Um, um, and also we can uh, get the title tomorrow if we beat Birmingham and Cardiff fail to beat Norwich, which they're fa failing to do at the moment. I think it's, it's currently nil nil. It's currently nil nil at the moment. So if it stays that way, or if or if Norwich take the lead uh, and go on to win the game, or 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 it's a draw, then that will mean we just need to win. And not only will be will be We'll be, we will be handed promotion if Fulham do beat Brentford. Um, not only will we be ha handed promotion um, after the win, uh, but we'll also have the title as well. Um, and oh, um, it's, cur it's currently nil nil at the moment. It's it's uh, just come up. Um, uh, it's just, it's just uh, come up at the moment. It's still nil nil. Uh, just kicked off in the second half, but. But yeah, if that the score stays that way, uh, and we win tomorrow, then get promotion, and then uh, we win the title along with that as well, which I think will be better. Um, we get the title as well, but promotion is always uh, the main, the, the main aim. Uh, the title, if it comes along with it, then it's like it's kind of like a, a so be it thing. So be it. If the title comes along, then then uh, happy days. So be it. Um, but the main aim is to get promotion tomorrow. Um, that's if Fulham do actually manage to beat Brentford, which I, I think is actually quite likely. Um, so I think it is quite likely that we will have to uh, beat Birmingham um, uh, tomorrow to get promotion. Uh, and I think we will. I think we will uh, be, beat um, Birmingham. The way that we played against Derby... Uh, on Wednesday was actually absolutely uh, incredible, absolutely incredible. We, we personally, I think we uh, we controlled the game from start to finish, um, and and Derby never really got a look in. Um, uh, Derby never really got a look in. They had the chances, but they they didn't put them away. Um, well, they didn't have much chances, but. Um, the chances they had, they didn't put put them away, um, and uh, the good thing is we we managed it managed to uh, limit them to uh, only a few chances, uh, which is quite good, um, and we can't we can't ignore uh, the absolute um, amazing goal um, from Ruben Neves that was scored, absolutely incredible, um, and it uh, I guess. Um, that goal went viral after, afterwards, uh, but you can't take away uh, the technique. The technique he had uh, to hit it up, um, to hit it up, uh, uh, and it to dip down um, um, over Scott Carson and into the back of the net it was absolutely incredible, and um, it, it's definitely goal of the season. Um, apparently the the uh, the goal of the season poll actually uh, the goal of the season poll actually um, uh, actually closed um, on midnight of uh, after the game, uh, which was a shame. It it, it wasn't um, um, able uh, to be put on uh, in time, but but personally. In in my opinion, in my opinion, that is the goal of the season, no doubt about it, hands down, that is the goal of the season, and um, whenever he scores a goal, it's never a bad goal. It's never a bad goal. It's always an absolute rocket. It's always an absolute rocket, an absolute worldie, and uh, it was an absolutely incredible goal. Birmingham, on the other hand, lost two one away to Bristol City. Um, they were 
I believe they were they went 2 0 down. Then they managed to get back in the game, but they just couldn't find that second goal. Um, and they lost away uh, to Bristol City uh, by two goals uh, to one. So they're they're pretty much really um, in the thick of it now. They're really in the thick of it. Um, and uh, Barnsley are currently beating Bolton one nil. Um, so they're climbing out of the relegation zone. Um, as it stands right now, so that will put uh, that will put Birmingham um, back in real trouble. Um, since Gary Monk's come in, they've improved. Uh, they have they have improved. They started to get a couple of results together uh, to to get them out of the mire. Um, before Steve Co- uh, uh, Gary Monk come in, uh, when Steve Cottrell was in charge, uh, they were in the thick of it. They were. In the bottom three, but since Gary Monk's uh, come in, they've, it, he's managed to turn it around a little bit, um, enough to um, cl- um, claw Birmingham out of the bottom three. But with the likes of Barnsley winning uh, currently, so if 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 results um, do go against them today, then they'll really want to fight for a point um, at least tomorrow because they really do need the points right now. That is what they need right now. They need the points uh, to try and survive in this division. They did it on the last day away at Bristol City uh, last season. Uh, they snatched a 1-0 win, uh, which kept them in the championship, which kept them in the division. Um, but if we do beat Blue tomorrow, we'll get promotion and we will put them really in the thick of the relegation dogfights. They're really in the dogfight right now to try and stay in division. Um, Steve Cottrell, uh, he, he, le- he left them um, in, in such a state, in, in the bottom three. Gary Munt, since he's come in, for fair play to him, he's managed to uh, turn uh, the ship around there. And he's managed to get them out of the bottom three, but with results... Uh, going against them currently, Barnsley beating Bolton by a goal to nil currently. Uh, so they'll be climbing out of the bottom three. Um, and um, and Birmingham will want um, Bolton to do something um, because because uh, Barnsley, I think they started, I think they started to the, the day um, third from bottom. Uh, so just um, in the bottom three, so Birmingham will want um, Bolton to uh, to to try um, and, and get back into the game uh, because obviously Barnes are trying to get out of the bottom three. Birmingham obviously not wanting to get sucked back into the bottom three. Currently lying in in twentieth in the championship right now. Um, um, and uh, they'll they'll be really wanting the points tomorrow. Um, they 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 really do need them. Um, and um, I think they they might they might um first of all play play for the point, and then if if that if that's going really well, then they might start playing for the win. Um. So it's not going to be easy for us. It's not going to be an easy game. It's not going to be a walk in the park. They're definitely going to make it hard for us. We're going to make it hard for them uh, to try and um, salvage any points from the game. We need a win, and they desperately need a win. Um, definitely um, more than us. Um, I think we'll we'll definitely go up anyway. Just time will tell. Well, whether we'll do it um, in in front of Birmingham. Uh, or we'll do it maybe against Bolton. Um, just time will tell, but I think we'll definitely go up. Uh, it's just if and when, really. Um, definitely, pro- probably not if, but but definitely when. When when will we get promoted? Is it against Blues, or will it be maybe it'll be against Bolton or Sheffield Wednesday? So yeah, um, I'm I'm thinking. I'm thinking uh, a 3-1 tomorrow. Birmingham might nick a goal back uh, towards the end. 
to uh, to try and um, uh, find a comeback, but I think it'll be too late for them, and we'll we'll walk away with victory and promotion, and maybe the title, maybe the title as well. Um, if Cardiff do slip up against uh, Norwich and fail to beat them, and then we can win promotion tomorrow. Uh, given that Fulham do beat Brentford, um, we can win promotion tomorrow and the title as well. We just need to win. So, if you did, did enjoy uh, this Wolves preview, uh, make sure to smash that like button and I shall see you after the game tomorrow where, hopefully, we will be a Premier League side next season. Until then, goodbye guys! Ah!